A deep chill is coming and pet owners rush to collect hay today from the local animal shelter. But how cold is too cold for our pets to be outside? Jacobus Roby has the answer. As the threat of extreme cold is expected to affect the deep south next week, people in the Meridian area are not only preparing to protect themselves, but their pets as well. Pets that are normally inside definitely need to be kept inside during cold weather. Now pets that are normally outside most of their life usually can maintain themselves if they have a good box or dog house or cover to get under. Dr. D.G. May is a veterinarian and expressed that the best way to protect pets is to understand the breed of the animal. Some breeds of dogs are able to handle the cold weather a lot better than others. Refer to your breed characteristics, uh, where they have been raised, and if they are used to climate changes. He also emphasized the importance of hydration and feeding the animals during the change of weather. Be sure that their water is not frozen solid because dogs have to have water accessible all the time. And their food, if you feed them a good warm food during the cold weather, that helps to warm them up as well. As for pet owner Ellie Purdy of Meridian, her dogs will be staying indoors. They have a um, little shed that they stay in sometimes and then also when it gets super bad outside we bring them inside and we have gates around the house to keep them contained so they aren't roaming around everywhere. With the extreme cold weather expected to impact next week, pet owners in the community are out getting prepared to make sure that their furry friends are safe. In Meridian, Jacob Osrobi, Fox 23 News.